Hey guys, what's up? It's Modern here. Today, I'll be going uh, with my friend Matt here to, we're going to the computer store. Uh, I'm gonna buy an Asus, I think it's a Z97-A uh, motherboard, uh, and a 4790K. So, I have the monies here, right here. So, uh, we're, uh, we're gonna go get it. Uh, it's 500, the motherboard, it's a motherboard and a, uh, CPU bundle, so yeah, it's 559, and I'm gonna get the warranty, of course. So yeah, um, this is an upgrade from my current uh, i7 950 first generation and my DX58 Smack over motherboard. So it'll be a uh, it'll be a nice upgrade. So I'm pretty excited. Drug deal. What is this? Yeah, that's that's drug dealage right there. Yeah. Yeah, that's fucking drug dealage if I've ever seen it. For sure. Put that in the video. Fucking right. Why wouldn't I put it in the video? That's a drug dealage. We got them. They're caught. They're caught them. Drug dealage. They need to let us through. Sorry, I'm recording with my phone, guys. I left my camera at my dad's, but it's, it's a good. I think it. It's a decent, we've got a decent, oh, oh yeah, there we go. We've got the iPhone 6, so it has the autofocus and shit, so, I mean, we're still, what the? Okay, so we've arrived, so now I'm just gonna go, uh, pick up that motherboard and that CPU. Alright guys, so we're here, uh, he's just getting them from the back, as you can see, they have them in stock. Uh, so yeah, I'm pretty excited to get these. Cause it's gonna be, it's four gigahertz, just a base clock. So that's really fast. All right guys, so we got it all. We got the i7-4790K right here. Base clock of four gigahertz, like I already said. Um, and we got our Z97A. Um, the reason why I picked this motherboard, cause there was cheaper, there was cheaper bundles. There was one that was I think 519 with the same CPU. Um, but I chose this one because that the motherboard for 519 didn't have optical audio. And because I use my A40s and A50s uh, on optical a lot, like a lot, a lot, uh, so that's why I went with the, this board, it's this board specifically. So yeah, we'll be right back with the building and the disassembling of my old computer. Well, yeah. <laughs> All right, guys, we're back now, and got the processor here. Sorry about the mess. Got the motherboard here. So. As you can see here, I've got my computer. I don't leave my computer on all day, for those wondering. I, I turn it off. I leave the VPN server on all day, but... So here, I'll just show you guys quickly. I have the i7 here, 950, first generation. 12 gigs of RAM. We're actually going to be putting in 16, because I have another 4 gigabyte stick. Um, here, I'll open Specky here real quick. Um, and you guys will be able to see here. So yeah, and then I have a DX58 smack over. 58 and then all right so shut down computer uh there's the computer right there uh we're gonna be unplugging everything from it yeah <laughs> all right so i'm just gonna push in that chair there and we're gonna just tilt the computer tip it over oh there's a screwdriver conveniently just right here just ready all right so we got all these uh all our expansion cards here unscrewed so we're just going to grab one gigabit if they were facing up. And I have another four, but I think it's at my dad's. I just took off my uh, H50 here and just look at that. I never really thought there'd be that much dust in it. I wasn't expecting there to be that much, but... Oh, you know what? I'm going to have an asthmatic fit, so I'm not going to do that in here. I'm going to do that elsewhere. But yeah, I'll be right back, guys. Okay, so I almost forgot to tell you guys this, but when you're building a computer, make sure all your standoffs, if you're using like the same, like if you're not, if you're just upgrading your computer, make sure all your standoffs are tightly screwed in and are in the right places. A standoff in the wrong place uh, could be the end of your motherboard. All right, so there's one standoff that I didn't need, which was right there, but all the rest of them are all good. Now I'm just gonna switch the back plates for the CPU there uh, so I can mount my H50 on the new board, on the new board and everything, so yeah. So we're just gonna 
ever so carefully. There we go. Okay, so our CPU is now installed. We're gonna. Why did that? Okay, well it worked. There we go. All right, so our CPU is now installed. So yeah, be right back. All right, guys. So I I skipped through the most awful and horrible part, which is mounting the this because I lost like one of the brackets. So it's very very rigged, pretty much. And I don't know where the washers are, so I just used uh, the I just used a heavy like two layers of duct tape, which worked extremely well on my. DX58 because when I didn't use the washer it created those and I didn't and that's obviously bad so yeah so oh and I wiped all the thermal paste off this now so yeah off my DX58 great motherboard great CPU if you're wondering what this is it's just for thermal paste relax okay anyways um <laughs> okay so we'll worry about those in a second this goes into the CPU yeah, there we go. Come on. What is this? Come on, it's- Oh, it's three pins. I'm such a fucking idiot. I swear to God. That's- That wasn't really too bad, but- I've- I've-, I've, I've I'm sure everybody has had worse moments than that. Alright, so we have our four pin CPU plug back here. What is this? Oh. Good thing I have- Small hands. There we go. Alright. There we go. Okay. There we go. Okay. Alright. Okay. We're good. I guess we'll find out when I turn on the computer. Kind of in a hurry to build this computer just because I got to go to my dad's in like probably under half an hour. So I'd like to get it done before then because tomorrow I have work right after school. Like, because I'm not with my dad, I'm not with my mom, and my computer's at my mom's. So, like, my I come here after school until my dad picks me up for about which is about like an hour and a half. So I don't have much time usually, I only have about an hour and a half, and yeah. Alright guys, I think everything is together now. Uh, I have a little extra blocks here. That little one with the things in it is from the VPN server's case. The VPN server looks so nice. <laughs> That's a huge fan. There's not actually that much dust in it, just the flash makes it pop so makes, uh, makes it look like there's more than there is. Um, so yeah, we got everything in place. Uh, everything mounted correctly. That little uh, thing that the motherboard came with. Uh, if you saw the mother, the unboxing of the motherboard that I did, uh, is really awesome. I'm just gonna put this underneath here. I'm gonna do way more. Uh, like this power supply is pretty much just temporary, so I'm gonna do. Hold on, so I put my phone down here. I'm gonna do a lot more. Um, what's it called? Ooh, nice focus there. All right, guys. So everything's plugged in here. Well, I got two monitors plugged in, Ethernet, uh, mouse. Well, this is actually just a USB hub, so webcam and blue snowball and other shit like that. Keyboard, and power. Yeah, I know the power supply. I know it's very temporary, guys. I'll probably get it. Okay, guys. So my phone ran out of space. Another thing I noticed is that the computer is extremely quiet compared to what it used to be at. Um, so as you can see, they're all running pretty low. By the way, this will probably cut off after about two minutes. So, yeah. Anyways, um, I don't know when it cut off. I have no idea. So there we go. So awesome. I'm so happy, guys. Oh, and one last thing is I'm going to have to reinstall Windows, unfortunately. Which really sucks. So, I'm going to be popping the SSD in there into the VPN server and backing it up. So, yeah, off to my. I have to go to my dad's now, so. Yeah, now it's actually goodbye. See you guys later. I need to clean up.